Well, I bought this house about two and a half years ago and I came down to the basement and I found a 3,000 square foot footprint of the house and I had a vision. I just needed somebody to, to help me realize that vision. And I was introduced to Pat and um, the rest of it uh, speaks for itself. Uh, Pat and his team did a great job. They are truly master craftsmen, especially Frank here. Um, so we're, we are thrilled with our basement. Hi, I'm Frank from Grand Interiors um, and home bars are one of the uh, projects that we love to work on. It is uh, certainly one of our specialties. In this particular bar, the clients wanted an industrial look with some reclaimed lumber worked into it. So the front wall of the bar has just that. It has reclaimed lumber, it has some stainless steel uh, also worked in to break up some of the wood. The lower part of the bar, we incorporate the appliances and down here we have a cabinet for trash, wine cooler, ice maker, but we can pretty much put anything you like behind the bar. So home theater is a really cool room to add to any project. You may take some chances in a home theater, you wouldn't take in other rooms because it's a novelty room. So if we start at the top and you look above my head, you'll see there's a multi-layered crown. Um, we have pilasters with recessed panels. Um, some wallpaper that kind of emulates snakeskin. And overall, there's a multi-colored gray theme going on here, as you can see. Um, very comfortable room, also insulated, so uh, keeping sound in and keeping sound out as well. It's just, it's one of our favorite rooms to do. standing here in the center of this giant, magnificent basement. The one unique feature about this basement is there's actually only one column. You're talking about 3,000 square foot space with only one column. This house was custom built with uh, giant steel beams, so it really led us to have this great wide open space, which works out really nicely. So we like to call this area the lounge area. You can see why. The homeowner wanted kind of a Brooklyn loft sort of a look and feel, so we did our best to achieve that. I think we did. Uh, we incorporated some red brick and um, the reclaimed wood behind me as an arch, a center column um, that you can see is wrapped with reclaimed wood, so we help disguise that. It plays well in this basement. Over by the entrance door, we have a bedroom with a full bath, and that bath also leads to the main common area. Adjacent to that, we have the gym, which we left completely open with a bunch of glass French doors, and uh, the space just really works out perfect. Hope you guys enjoyed this really unique, amazing basement and follow us on all our social media. We're always posting some great stuff and I just want to thank these guys. I really appreciate it. Cheers. <laughs>